Well, welcome and good evening, you wonderful dice of all alignments. I am Lunar D8, and I have no idea what to call this playlist. Probably just hentai games that I consider trying to let's play, and then it turns out that... No. No. It... So, it would make more sense in context. Like originally, this would have been you know, a playlist called Let's Play Eden's Ritter, because it's supposed to be a dark fantasy... Um, you know, visual novel that I didn't expect to be a full-on hentai. I, I mean, I expected there'd probably be some nude scenes, but I was like, you know what, I could probably just see those coming, and I'll, I'll know about it, and I can, like, stop the video before that. But no. It just full-on just went from zero to a hundred instantly with no real warning and then I swear there was so much nudity like there was so much nudity sex nipples and dicks in every square centimeter of the entire fucking screen even under the text was more dicks and more nipples it was also a little more violent than I expected too so, that was, uh, holy shit. So, um, I can't edit or censor stuff worth a shit. I mean, if you're curious about that, I mean, try to look up my monster, what's Monster Girl Island video that I did like a year ago or so. I tried to edit. Then again, my defense, half that screen was boobs. So, yeah. I remember they were saying that there was some sort of... Oh, uh, yeah. There was another video I mentioned I might put a link in the description of. So, the, the first... I'll put two links in this description. The first one will be Monster Girl Island, and the second one will be... the thing that I talked about in the video. But yeah, I'm actually going to play the audio from the game... Also, I considered trying to use a screenshot of the stuff in the store page, but honestly, like, the girl on the left, like, I was making jokes in the Alien Removal Division game, as well as the, um, which I hadn't played this thing at all until after, Alien Removal Division thing, as well as, um, in Sound Mind. I was actually referencing when I was saying a six-foot-tall sexy martial artist with K-cup boobs. I was actually uh, referencing the main character from the Booty Royale manga that I, you know, made a video talking about in um, the I Bought or Did Something playlist, which was like a few days ago or something. Also, at that time I had read the manga at all. I've read the manga since then. It is, um, oh my god, is it graphic in every way you could expect. And I was like, I, it was like a lot of things that I did not expect to occur occurred. So, surprises? I don't, yay or nay, I don't know. But I'm just saying, you know, the person, the main character, Misora, So, I joked about that a bit in Alien Removal Division and in, in Sound Mind. But I, I swear that the person on the left here probably even has bigger boobs. But the thing is, I can't even show a screenshot. Because even when she's wearing full, you know, medieval fighting armor that's meant to protect you from, you know, swords and stuff, even though it's not... Like it's not lingerie, it's actual armor. Not only is it skimpy and not only covering the areas that are, you know, you know, the way you would expect bikini fan service -y stuff to be, the one on the left's armor is so thin that you actually see every every pixel of the high quality nipple. Even though it's 
covered by armor. It's almost as if it's more nude than naked. That, that shouldn't be possible. Now I'm imagining that tree in the background is it's broccoli. I've been trying to eat more vegetables lately. I'm trying to be healthy. But main point is this. Yeah, I, I was... Spent, oh, okay, like maybe there might be a slight bit of nudity here and there in this, and I'd see it coming, and I either you know stop the video before, or I could like edit and like I could just do a sensor bar over it. No, it's the entire screen, the entire screen. There was not any part of this, even the area where the text was underneath it was just more dicks and more tits. It was just, it's. Like, if we were to use, like, SCP classes to describe, like, this game in terms of hentai, its level of how fucking pornographic it is is Keter. It's Keter. It, it's Keter level of all of that. So, yeah. <laughs> so, I will not be able to do a Let's Play on it because... It, there is no censoring this. Plus, in general, I don't. I'm terrible at editing. I don't like editing or censoring stuff. Like I said, the first link will be the Monster Girl Island. The second link will be the thing where I referenced in the video. The third one will actually be part one of the um, bought something playlist, which is actually about the only wholesome thing that's in that playlist. So, going to go down here, select this. Why is it not working? And you get to hear my, at least, audio of my, it's kind of like, it's still kind of funny that when I played Five Nights at Freddy's, did one part that's like half hour long and it's audio only and it's just because you know the game kept crashing and I couldn't get it to actually record footage so yeah well welcome and good evening wonderful dice of all alignments I am Lunar D8 and this is Let's Play Eden's Ritter which I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right uh, OBS is working fine. <coughs> so, let's hop into this. Can I use my controller? No. <sighs> yes, it is. I'll probably have to go to sleep this after this. This is a dark fantasy visual novel, which may or may not be pornographic. It is. Past me, you're so naive. So we're just gonna hope that the game does not force me to edit things because oh, there's no chance of us. I can't this. edit worth a shit. I mean, anyone who watched me try to edit Monster Girl Island, well, you get the idea. Yeah, I do. It was a lovely day in Ellerald. I'm a terrible narrator. This holy kingdom was home to the main church of the Eller. Aldian faith, where the god tree Sephiroth her Sephir was enshrined. I still don't know how to pronounce that. Day blessed the prayer. I still think it's kind of funny how like the Latin course, like how like not only some song lyrics can be misheard in a language you're aware of, like English words heard as other English words, but like you can hear words of other languages. Like take uh, the Zero Two Dance song, Beyond Con. Um, that there's one lyric in it that's <sighs> hang your ham sword, which is kind of hilarious because you know it's. Oh, if I did have to, I love you. Recommend. You know, I'll put a link to that in the description. I did a horror visual novel. Definitely not pornographic. Uh, and the letter. I'm hoping that this game does not it's very long. make me have to try to learn how to edit things. Oh, I'm never going to learn how to edit. I, I don't want to edit things. I still don't. I don't like editing. I don't. Because I'm lazy. That's true. Uh, like, a Latin course for the Sephiroth song, I just imagine it's more like bells, frogs, big cherries, Tinker Bell, ham and cheese. I wonder if Sephiroth. I could sing, sing 
in sync frogs, big cherries, cherries Tinkerbell, Bell, ham and cheese, Seth Roth. Okay. <laughs> Trying to sing in sync with myself. Of children running through the streets and adults watching their children play. The slight brout. Apparently I can't fucking read. It's like, what's that guy doing drowning in the middle of the pool? He's synchronized swimming with himself. I'm just going to put the letter L in everything. Blue thing, blem, blue, off. Okay, that's just going to... Yeah, it didn't sound as bad as I thought it did. <sighs> Sorry. Well, that part sounded worse. I had to um, Tinkerbell. Daily that have been continue forever. It was another blessed day in the world of Navi. A beautiful day. Oh, look at the architecture. Ooh, you know, this voice acting is pretty good. You know, I think I figured out what I'm going to put in the title acting, guys. of the playlist. Voice acting. Because it's extended for me. As I like, I, I've only played 14 minutes of this game so far, but... I think it's supposed to mean egress and exited. I have two things to say. One blazoned is extremely pornographic, and it is very, very raunchy. Easier to pronounce words. It is. This, this game is unbelievably raunchy. I also plan to play more of it. Why? Just not. This would be in a recording. Different feel. This is like... Okay. The man who stood before me was Archbishop. Trying to scratch Moses. my scalp. Half a year after the demise of his predecessor. Oh, uh, I'm sure he is completely innocent there. The Xenobide Rudolph, who had plotted to overthrow the... Okay. Position was found needful to the country's smooth functioning. He was <sighs> temporarily appointed. But as he <sighs> can go, he pulled it toward him. Okay. Okay, at least we didn't fall, I guess. It feels a little weird, man. It does. Are you, are you running a fever? Is everyone like gonna die of fevers and become zombies? That would still be interesting. What is holding this necklace together? Faith. This feels a little creepy when you say it that way. Oh, it's actually creepier than I gave it credit for. Please don't talk to me anymore. I feel uncomfortable with you now. <laughs> I actually feel more uncomfortable the second time through. Okay, so. No, I'm getting an axe later. It's gonna. It's gonna be really cool. To have like eldritch signs all over it. Sounds awesome! Do you have a lightsaber axe? I'm just curious about what's in this book. Then again, I have a tendency to want to read everything in yeah, existence. I do. It's probably a word for that. I would be terrible in the fucking Evil Dead movies. Bruce Campbell would be like, anything you do, don't read the book. And I'm like, did you say book? He's like, no. Lunar! Lunar, stop reading! <laughs> it's okay! We have a wall of chainsaws, Bruce Campbell. I still remember how he played Autolycus in The Legend of Hercules. This is a little creepy in this situation. <sighs> yeah, really sleepy. <sighs> what is past me yawning too? Which trial? Yeah, the so called witch trial does not. That, that's a, How is that. Even from the perspective of a dude who is playing a very edgy game. I feel very uncomfortable. Future me from 10 minutes in the future I also feel feels uncomfortable. A bit creeped out. Still gonna play more of the game. Just, just saying. I mean, heck, we all do that with horror games too. Like, there's parts of the game that, oh, it's uncomfortable. There's the SCP monster that's chasing you. Okay. okay. But you still kept playing SCP Containment Breach. Okay. 
You know, it's, I guess it's the same genre, right? There's horror game and horror game. It's okay. just extra syllables. And... Okay. Everywhere. There's so much cum. And dicks and tits and everything everywhere. Past me is just trying to figure out how would I edit this? How would I censor it? And the answer is it's not possible. There's no way to possibly censor this. Because holy shit. Yeah, I'm trying to look in the configuration right now to see if like if there's a blur option. Like, okay, maybe I can just restart the recording and be like, oh, okay, I'll just get the thing that like hides the explicit content. And then, you know, go back myself for non-recorded viewing. But, yeah, there is no such option as obscure titties. There is no setting in the menus for that. So, yeah. <laughs> there was no fixing that. Anyway. Yeah, I... I would say it feels awkward to end the video, but really at this point there's nothing more I could say to make the video any more awkward. So. I don't know, the only thing I can say is like, like, you remember that movie called Into the Woods? It was like a musical thing. I went into that thing in theaters expecting it to be a straight up horror movie. An actual like, you know, Nightmare on Elm Street style movie. And then when they started singing... I was um, very, very taken aback. And I was wondering, okay, this is an odd introduction, but okay. And then the singing never stopped. <laughs> okay, bye.